Meghan and Harry announce they plan tea birthday party for daughter Lilibet. Prince Harry and Meghan's fans are planning a tea birthday party for Lilibet as the tot is set to turn one. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex's daughter celebrates her first birthday on the 4th of June. Fans of the couple, dubbed the Sussex Squad, shared plans on Twitter for a virtual tea party to celebrate the special occasion. One Twitter user with a handle at Jediva Runner posted, Sussex Squad Breaking News. Lilibet Diana's birthday party has been changed to a high tea birthday party. So save the date and get your tea sets and fascinators ready. The post attracted hundreds of retweets, likes and comments from other fans of the Sussexes. One with the handle Loren Hamburg wrote, so excited to celebrate this big moment. Another, at Inspire Editors, commented, a reason to get out my fancy teacups and one of my vintage hats. A third with the handle at Prickbeal added, can't wait to celebrate Lilibet's birth date, Sussex Squid. Another, at Elmon Campus, said, oh, how fun. I have my tea set. I have the perfect outfit. I just need a fascinator. I'm on it. One more, at V Victory, commented, that's awesome. She is a princess after all so we need to do this right. The Sussex squad has previously marked birthdays for Archie with online events such as fundraisers. Lily is set to spend her first birthday in the UK as it falls during the Platinum Jubilee weekend. Harry and Meghan are travelling to Britain from California to join the royal celebrations in June. The Sussex's attendance at the Platinum Jubilee was confirmed earlier this month following intense speculation. A spokeswoman for the couple said, Prince Harry and Meghan, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are excited and honoured to attend the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations this June with their children. It will be the first time Harry and Meghan have brought their family to the UK since leaving for the US. It is not known which parts of the Fiday weekend they will make an appearance. They will not appear on Buckingham Palace's balcony during Trooping the Colour on Thursday the 2nd of June. After the Queen limited the moment to working royals only. Harry and Meghan are living in Montecito with Archie, 3 and Lily after quitting royal duties in 2020. Meghan hopes to expand childcare support for workers. Meghan has broken her silence following the news that she will visit the United Kingdom for the Queen's upcoming Platinum Jubilee celebrations. On Wednesday the mum of two joined the Marshall Plan for Moms in announcing a national business coalition for childcare. In collaboration with Meghan and Prince Harry's Rakhul Foundation, that hopes to expand child care support for workers. The Marshall Plan for Moms is a movement to center mothers in the country's economic recovery by advocating for policies that support moms. Families everywhere, and especially working moms, are asked to shoulder so much, Meghan said in a statement. This has only been heightened by the pandemic, with increased caregiving responsibilities, rising prices, and economic uncertainty. As it's been said many times, it takes a village to raise a child, she added. Today, we're sending a message that childcare isn't just a community imperative. It's a business imperative. Creating a stronger workforce starts with meeting the needs of families. The statement comes after it was confirmed that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are bringing their children Archie and Lilibet to the UK in June 2022. A spokeswoman for Harry and Meghan said, Prince Harry and Meghan, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are excited and how not to attend the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations this June with their children. It will be the first time Harry and Meghan have brought their family to the UK since leaving for the US in 2020. The Duke previously said he had wanted to return to his home country but felt it wasn't safe due to his lack of security. Their daughter Lilibet, who was named after Her Majesty, was born in June 2021 but has never met a great-grandmother nor her extended family. Lily, as she is called, has also not been pictured in public and has only been photographed once for the Sussex's Christmas card last year. Playtime at Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's house. James Corden, who recently announced he's departing the Late Late Show next year, is opening up about his friendship with the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, including getting their kids together for a play date. I have, he told the son when asked if he's visited Harry and Meghan at their Montecito home. It was more a sort of play date scenario, with the kids. Then we went out for dinner after, it was lovely. Obviously, I'm not telling you anymore. Obviously.
Corden added that his personal experience with Meghan and Prince Harry has been nothing but positive. Look, I'm a huge fan of both of them, he said. Obviously, I know Harry better than I know Meghan but I think it's really hard to judge or be judgmental. The TV host said that he has a huge amount of respect and admiration for Harry. And anyone who has been around him and spent time with him would feel exactly the same way. I think he is a devoted and loving husband and father. And I think what they have done, in turning away from royal life, is incredibly brave, and I'll always be in their corner, he continued. Afterward though, at the evening reception, I did make a joke, dress, ed up as Henry V.I. And told everyone, George Clooney's here, so congratulations on your new Nespresso machine, guys he said. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos, thank you very much.